Saturday bright and early. Um, I don't think, I know I, I, I just started, but I don't think I vlogged last night when I was preparing all of this stuff for a competition. But daddy helped put the big dance bag in the trunk and all the kids are eating their ego to go hold it a second. And um, what do you call this? They have all their bags. They're watching Beauty and the Beast and the sun is starting to rise. The goal was to leave at 6.30. We were seven minutes behind. We left at 6.37, but still good timing. I think their first workshop starts at 7.45. What does it say? I have my sassy pants on. That's for Mumsy. Share with her. It's so nice out there. Get it how I live it. I live it how I get it. Come to my fucking digits. I pull it with a lemon. Not cause she ain't living. It's just the eyes get a city. And this ain't a scrimmage. Just had their lunch break and now they're all going crazy playing outside here. Colby's over there. She wants to be included. Hyper. You ready for your jazz? Yeah. Candyman routine? Yeah. Dancing since 7.30 and it's now 3 o'clock. Yeah. How nice it is here. There's a pool. The lake is over there. This one's waking up. Hi, baby. Oh. You awake? You ready for the next one? What's next? Injection. Um, everyday heroes. Are you ready for tap? Good job. You made me cry in your last one. We're done. Awards are done. Come on. Let's You're going to go watch? Okay, I'm going to put the stuff in the car. Dylan, what do you uh, Finally done, right? Yes. Are we leaving after you guys are done eating? Because I'm tired. We gotta be come back here tomorrow morning again at 7. Or leave at the same time because they have workshops. I need more coffee. Actually, I didn't even have coffee. I had chai tea latte. So I'm oh, in yeah. dire need of coffee. We're having our dinner here. Even though half the people left and half the people are still performing. So they're so smart. I guess they do this. Maybe they did this last year. So they made a buffet like this, like a taco buffet, nachos buffet for lunch. And now for dinner, they have like a sandwich station. Basically, they ask for $20 per person who wants to be part of the food. So you get a lunch, you get dinner, and then lunch tomorrow. And then you just eat 
unlimited whatever and there's always, like lots of fruits and snacks and drinks and stuff well, like no, that so I think it's worth it because you don't have to worry about like, leaving well, and coming back and all of that and Emily's eating unlimited nachos over here hey we're here we're here we're done for now okay, so this time I put there before I had the stroller and then I put the bag on top and now I put the bag there and I could just stand the stroller upright let me Thank you. Okay, you too. That was the longest I've ever waited. Relax. We're in Paris. Maybe not the longest, but right turn at the end of the road. Good morning. Happy Sunday. We're back. Sun. In half of a mile, left turn. The sun is rising. And we are tired, but determined to make today happen. The kids are watching their movie. Good morning, guys. So where's the dance school? Mm. Relax. Colby fell back Enjoy asleep, Paris. thankfully, after I changed her and put her in, and we are off. Late start to today because I needed to get my Dunkin' Donuts because yesterday that Starbucks in the inside of the hotel or that store that serves Starbucks in the hotel wasn't cutting it because that line was way too long and I don't get the coffee at Starbucks I get the chai tea so I needed my and I got a, a large one today so hopefully it lasts me So, Emmeline dropped off Dylan and Malia at their classes while I parked, and this one's wide awake now. And look at this pretty view here. You can see, look at that, really close Vegas. So pretty. How pretty it is here. Look how pretty it is here. That's a golf course right there. And this is the lake. Lake Las Vegas. Beautiful. Hey, what's the puppy's name, Colby? Ace, yes their um, dance directors and their on her daughter's uh, puppy okay we're trying to find a decent angle to take a picture over here with the car but <laughs> and I are taking a walk look how beautiful it is here water behind the hotel and nobody's over here. It's so peaceful. What are you doing? Okay, look who's here. Hey, babe. This is Mommy in Makeup Land on Instagram and she has a blog. Check her out and there's three of her four kids and her hubby that came to pass by because they don't live too far from here, right? Yeah, not that far. Not that far. Emily, what are you doing? Uh, on nationals cool Dee, for the same thing yay good job Dee. I need finally home I 
wanted to show you guys before I take the stuff out. I didn't take this out last night, but I left it in here because I wanted to show you guys how much cargo space there was here. I mean, I had my stroller, this, and then I even had our other bags on top here before, but right now the kids are holding it. Three or four of them are asleep. Um, we're going to go have dinner later with Daddy. He's going to get out of work a little early, and we'll celebrate when they wake up. What did you choose to eat? <laughs> we tried to eat a cheesecake factory, but the wait was like an hour. So we came here on a school night. Dylan had some crab legs, and he's eating soup. We had sushi. Hi to mommy. Colby's eating sushi. Dessert time. What are you eating? What are you eating? Ice cream. She's eating ice cream, but she's biting from the bottom. She's biting her ice cream from the bottom. Does anybody else do that? What are you eating? Is it good? Okay. I won't get any then. <laughs> no, no. No, I don't know what else I want. Good? Good? Tired, huh? Saying that the nurse swapped her mouth because to make sure she doesn't strap. The other two are in the waiting room. And on top of all that, well, Brian ended up feeling better this morning. Um, I'm just waiting for the results of his ultrasound. His blood work showed low thyroid, borderline low thyroid. I'm just worried if he's going to need surgery, but if he does, I want him to do it ASAP because he's just having bad, that pressure after he eats. Anyway, I'm um, just trying to stay positive despite all of them being with me. And on top of all that, his phone died. Like, died as in, like, doesn't turn on. So, he doesn't have a phone right now. He had to go settle something with the car rental and get an oil change, I think. And then we have to go get another phone. Here in Walmart, we went to AT&T. Daddy needed his new phone. And they didn't go to dance today because they didn't go to school. Hello. And now we're getting a freebie. Just did some groceries. We're gonna do taco night. Taco Monday. What'd you get? I love jockey. What is that? You love chocolate? Mia, watch out. Let me move. You love chocolate? What else did you get? Where's your toy? Oh my god. What is it? It's a baby chick. Cute. Hmm? I missed it. She was pretending to give to Dylan. She put it in her mouth. Will you can have some? Oh, what a good sister. <laughs> Thank you. It's going all over your hand. Thank you, Daddy. Brian had to force me to get my pedicure. Thank you, Mom and Daddy. Thank you, Mom and Daddy. You're welcome. Your excuse. What was your excuse? Well, I was making excuses. I didn't bring my slippers. The lady goes, I have slippers. <laughs> The lady in there was like, oh, you have good husband. Most Asians, she was saying like most Asians, you know, men or something like don't, like they let the women like do everything. So you had, cause she saw that we were at Walmart and she saw Brian with the four kids and our full cart of groceries, like go to the car and he was like telling me go, go. When they were saying, yeah, that you're a good husband. I said, yeah, he is. <laughs> so what are we gonna have now? Tacos? Yeah! And Yay! avocado Yay! guacamole? Yeah! Guacamole! Yeah! Yeah! If we're friends, why are you Taco Tuesday, Mexican Monday! Look, it's a new Filipino thing! Filipino Mexican Monday. Yeah, Mexican Monday. Okay. But there needs to be M. Mexican Filipino. We're not Mexican. Filipino, Filipino Wednesday. Filipino, Filipino Friday. <laughs> Filipino Wednesday. Yeah, Mexican Monday is good. Mexican Monday, look. You guys are being good in the car. See, we wouldn't. Listen, we wouldn't have been able. We wouldn't have been able to have the kids wait for me in the car with Brian peacefully without this thing right here, which we need. Guys, sorry I haven't vlogged in a few days since Monday. I meant to pull out the camera, but 
Yeah, Monday was crazy with them all being home and Malia getting strep. Did I even tell you that they said she had strep? But she went back to school the next day because she was already on her antibiotics. But um, my, my throat was starting to feel scratchy and I kept coughing all night into this morning and I ended up canceling. I was supposed to go meet up with some moms at Springs Preserve, but I ended up canceling that and just taking care of stuff at home. I ended up also going to the laundromat to do half of our laundry. It was my first time going to the laundromat here. It was kind of nice getting to do three loads at once. I was able to like knock it out like that. Um, I think I was only there a little over an hour. Um, she fell back asleep. I'm right here now at Dance Connection only because um, I came from picking up Malia from tutoring. I dropped off the other two at 4, picked her up at her school for 30. I waited in the parking lot for 30 minutes and now I'm waiting for another 20 minutes for Emmeline to be done at 5. Then drop her off at Prodigy. And then I'm debating if I'm going to do some errands. If she stays asleep, I might just go straight home. Um, I've got to cook dinner, but I do actually have to pick up a few things. So, let's see. But I am really bummed. Every time I try out a minivan, especially, I get so sad because I want this to be my life. Minivan life. Like, look how much space there is. I love the captain's chairs, I love how spacious it is, extra cargo, extra storage, all the DVDs are in here, because the DVD player is on all the time, lots of cup holders and all that, ah, I'm so jealous of you moms that have minivans, because I never thought the day would come where I would be like, oh, what a minivan, but maybe one day, maybe one day, so they're going to pick this up on Friday. And I'm just kind of bummed about it, but it's okay. I'm trying to live it up for now, having this car for the next few days. Happy Thursday! So, yeah, okay, you're done. Okay, put it there, baby. So, I had an early day today with Colby. I took her to a meeting after I dropped off the kids at school. I had a meeting at 9.30 in Town Square at the park store. Um... I think it's okay to mention it now by the time this vlog goes up so since I'm so behind um, we'll already have announced it but we're having an event um, with Anna who is hey it's Anna Banana on Instagram she's a huge um, fashion blogger um, an influencer and she's having her first meetup and we're so fortunate enough to partner her with her on this and with the park store which is a beautiful um, women's clothing boutique in um, Town Square um, so I had to meet with the owners and the marketing director and Anna and finalize like all the last bits of details we're gonna have a fun itinerary fashion show music um, light bites drinks raffles giveaways all that good stuff so um, if you guys are in the area, we'd love if you came. It's Sunday, April 29th from 2 to 5 p.m. Um, I'll leave a link down below where you can RSVP. But um, right now I am at Baby Sex Cafe here in Centennial Hills because they invited me to try out some of their uh, menu items. And I'm meeting my friend Christy here. And she's bringing two of her kids. And I have Colby. So... I actually went home first and I came back out. It is a late breakfast brunch. It looks kind of crowded, so I hope we get seated. Hey, baby sex, say hi. We're waiting for a table. Look, it's kind of crowded for a freaking Thursday, but we got three of our eight kids. Colby's there making friends with <laughs> somebody. And then Wayne and Wyatt. Colby. Kids got their meals. What is this called, Christy? LJ Scramble. LJ Scramble. It's scrambled bacon. Bacon, scrambled eggs, cheddar cheese, hash brown or potatoes, orange, and a pancake. Oh my god, let me take the syrup away from her. Oh, perfect. Whoa, that is ginormous. Holy crap. Here we go. Perfect. 
my um, adobo now fried me, almond. Almond. Uh, no, I'm, I'm okay. Yeah, thank you. I need a, a good picture. Ready to dig in. Finally took my pictures. And now we're gonna eat. So I dropped off the girls and I have Dylan and Colby. We are at the World Market Center. And this is the Pavilions Las Vegas Market because we're here for the Tom's Warehouse Sale. I wanna see how good is this because I heard about it even before. I um, moved here. This is what it looks like for the warehouse sale. They're all organized by sizes, women's. Let me look at the kids stuff first, then I'll look for me. Grow, let's see the one and a half. So this pair that I'm looking at for Dylan, they're $9.99. Like all these are $9.99. That's so cheap, that's too light. I'm trying to narrow this down. <laughs> And I'm ask, I'm, I keep texting my mom pictures of some too because I know she loves Tom's. I'm waiting for her to text me back. Hey, what are you going to miss most about this car? Oh, the TV. Oh, they're watching it right now. They're oh. getting out the car to go to school. Alrighty. Bye, Ben. Bye, Bye Toyota Bye. Sienna. <coughs> Bye, Panda. Said she's going to miss something else. What? The seats are so comfy and it's spacious, she said. So as you can see, it shows here how much mileage is left because the gas is on low, but they're about to pick it up and there's a gas station like less than a mile away. So um, I like that it tells you the mileage left. Um, it also, if that wasn't there, it also does show you like the speed limit which I like. I like that feature. It's, it'll have like a little box here saying like 25 miles per hour or whatever it is and how fast you're going. Um, it's a touchscreen um, navigation as well as <clears throat> for all the other features on the this um, dash area. Um, there are, um, what do you call this? These, they also have the controls for the rear um, climate control as well as in the front dual sunroofs which I didn't utilize as much as I would have liked to in this um, console there's one two three four and up here um, five six there's six cup holders <coughs> just in the front alone that's not including on the side of the door um, and then in the back there are cup holders as well so it is a great family car, and I'm really bummed that we're giving it back. But the coolest part, check this out. Oh my gosh. If I didn't have to drive, and I was a passenger, I would totally take advantage of sitting here watching a movie. Just like this. So thank you, Toyota for um, giving us the Toyota, 2018 Toyota Sienna to drive, just drive for the week. Hope we get to try you out again soon. Okay, so Toyota came to switch out the car, so we got the Toyota RAV4, and I'm just doing some like little groceries. I went to Albertsons, and then I went to Target Mama. to get some things before Mama. the kids start spring break, because I do not feel like grocery shopping with all four of them. So I just got some things to cook for the next few days and snacks and such, toilet paper and all that before our next Costco trip in April. And you want the cheese balls? So there is a pretty good amount of space in here. Look at this um, like elevated compartment. I put the bread in here. So, okay, cheese balls. You want cheese balls? Yeah, okay. Upside of going to the grocery with just Colby is I get what I need. Downside is I don't have help putting everything away. Okay, let's start putting things away.
just came from Smoothie King because Dylan found a free smoothie card. Where did you find it, Dylan? Right on the floor. So we came to get a free smoothie. Oh. They're lost. You're game. Let's go. Okay, we just got Emily from Dance. It's salt. We got in and out today for lunch since we don't, didn't go out yesterday for Friday Friday fun day. Uh, no. I don't know. <laughs> Monday. I don't know what to call it. No, treat of the week. Treat of the week, okay. Saturday yeah. calm day.